Uh, well, hello. Uh, I'm back. <clears throat> I put down three o'clock on the card, and then I came back early, but I always do that. So here we are again. I'm really enjoying <laughs> this little... Uh, it's not a bug, right? It's a feature. Uh, I'm going to run straight past my little save beacon here. Watch. Boom! No, you're not, Scooter. Look what happened. You found yourself outside of an actual building that wasn't there before. That's all right. I don't mind. That's a, a small little glitch. Welcome back, people. Whoever is going to come back. Had a few people watching earlier today. But I got hungry. So, uh, went out and got myself a little delicious treat. I am watered, aided, and ready to go. So let's just jump back into it. It's the weekend. <laughs> I'm slow grinding here. Slow rolling with Scooter. Oh, Scooter, say hello. Would you say hello to the people? Thank you. I'm going to put some more gestures in there for him, but I'm not going to lie. That is my favorite. Oh, hold on. Let me see something here. Uh, i got to turn this up to see what the volume sounds like. I think that's all right. I'm going to turn that down. It sounds like it might be a little low, but I'm going to leave it. It's uh, audible. So if anybody comes out and complains, I'll adjust it. Let's see what we got to do here. My researchers are concerned by a trend for what? I think that's a mistake. That's a broken. There was supposed to be something in there. Ban, ban percentage, item consumption. I don't. I don't want my citizens having any more items. Consumption among the citizens. Such things cannot be permitted. They demand an immediate ban. Okay, here's the big question. Do I ban all items? And I wonder if, uh, I mean, that I don't know how big this error is. If I hit ban, is it going to ban everything the citizens have access to? Let me look at this. Minus 2% citizen happiness, minus 27. You know what? Uh, I have to say no given what limited information I have. Oh, well, that's interesting. There's a there's a little glitch I've never seen before. Again, not a big deal, but I want my people to be happy. Let's see. And I don't really care about maintenance costs. This my 74% happiness. I'll take it. I'm happy with it. They're going to come up with a proposal in half an hour. Let's go up to the ship, see where our frigates are at the moment. Uh, thank you to the two subscribers that subscribed during the last stream. That was awesome. You can see up there I put... Uh, I don't normally do this, but... I mean, people can do it and not do it. I'm looking for... Trying to get up to 300 subscribers. Um, I'm looking at... What does online discovery services mean? I, I still... Uh, is that the people that put up the custom things? I don't know. Let's get up to the ship. So many strange things happening today. You'd think it was Halloween again. All right. I hope the the sound is gonna. I'm gonna turn this up one more time. Give me a second, guys. I apologize. Yeah, yeah, that that sounds fine. I can hear it, and my phone is about a foot and a half away. So I think that's loud enough. Uh, I tend to talk a little low, but I've. I've adjusted my mic accordingly. What am I doing? Let's go. Uh, I I got a bunch of missions out, right? Let me look and see if I see any little ship icons. I do not, which I'm not surprised by. I uh, I sent those out not too long ago. So, a part of it is... Give me a sec. I can do some adjustment here. Always doing adjustments. I started using uh, whatever this uh, screen is for on my mic. I decided to finally start using it. And I think it's causing me to have my mic be a little bit farther away from my mouth. There we go. No more. No more uh, yik yakking about that kind of stuff. Yik yakking. That's my new word, I guess. Uh, what I did not really pay close attention to is see if anybody has turned orange in here. And those guys look good. <clears throat> Don't see any orange damage there. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. That's one mission. And that is two missions. So it just must not have reset yet because he's not showing me any out of the five missions. Well, that's all right. 
Got other things to do. Let's go back. I'm just going to work. I think my rule, well, although I don't have many rules and they change constantly, but I'm going to go from the bottom up. Uh, this guy, I think, we're stuck for a while because, hi, how you doing? Got show to you. Namaste. Is that what you say? I think so. Uh, 13 hours on that. That ain't going to happen today. So let's go to this guy. I killed. Huh, I thought I collected you. You guys grow that fast? Well, you're not ready. Let's see if... Nope. None of those guys are ready to be harvested. Where is... My armor is over here. I need to wake that scientist up. Hey, buddy. Good to see you, Bali. It is done, interloper. Oh, is it done? Sorry, I thought he was making a proclamation. He was not. He was interrogating me. Have you purged these vile beings from our air? Confirm. Grah. Well fault, interloper. Fought. To be young. To kill again. Grah. How I envy you. You know, hold on. Interloper. There is both good and bad news. Great. I love that. Some of the pirates appear to have fled from fled your wrath. But this merely delays their righteous extermination, right? Hunt them down, interrogate them for potential weapons technology, and then consign, con, consign them to the Great Abyss. Grah! Uh, he's clearly possessed by the thrill of the hunt, but this energy cannot disguise the fact they appear to be weakening. Has residing here in my base caused them to become ill? The armor... Oh, good lord, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I readjusted my mic and the bar was a little bit lower and I gave it a little bit of coffee. Fortunately, nothing spilled. The armorer wishes for me to find one of the escape pirates and take any technology they might possess. Sure, why not? Why would I decline that great offer? This is your prize, interloper. Weapons technology and a pirate to do with as you will. Grah! Make our ancestors proud. Sure thing. Hold on. I've got myself... I don't have a camera on me, and I don't want to have one, but I look like I'm stuck inside something in the Matrix, the way I have this mic set up. I'm going to have to readjust this, but I'm not going to play with it now. Hold on. i got to be a little more cautious when I'm doing my coffee now. That's all there is to it. Find an interrogated pirates. Okay, I'll do that. Brr. Uh, where am I going? I see that icon. Is it outside there? Of course it is. No, uh, I'm going to take a gamble that he is in our my solar system here. Hopefully. Just uh, want to take a quick peek, see if any ships are over here. I'm trying to... Uh, nothing. Boy, when this, when this place is... Is it opening? It is. It means the ship's coming in. I think they're coming in from both sides. I want to check to see if they got any hydra uh, dihydrogen gel. Jelly? Gel. I think it's jelly. Or tritium. Two things. Okay, well, that's what that normally means. I didn't get in my starship. That one's opening now. How long does it take the ships to get in? When do we open that for their approach? Relatively early, it looks like. I'm going to have to look at that bounciness there. Hey, you guys, you want to take a look at that uh, landing pad? Looks a little bit precarious. Okay. Don't really want to chit-chat. Just want to do this. And you know what? I just realized. I always forget to do this. I, I can sell them the stuff in a while. And I know I have some. <clears throat> Uh, Gravitino Ball. I'm going to be getting lots of those, I think, so... I'm going to get rid of that one. Uh, look at that. Two million. Screw it. I'm selling to this guy. Good lord. I was going to take it. I just don't have the patience. I don't have the patience to go down to the planet just now and uh, take it to one of those vaults. I'm not going to do it. Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir, for your time. Very much appreciated. I am very laid back today. Oh, 
You son of a gun. He saw me coming and said, I'm out of here, man. All that guy ever does, like, hey, you got any tritium on you? Any, any jelly? All right, before I launch, let me take a little drink. I'm not sure this screen really does. I'm not here. Ship, I got to go. I'm not sure this screen in front of my mic really does anything, and the way it is laid out, the goose arm for it, really gets in the way of things. So, I might get rid of that. I I, I couldn't tell any difference when I was listening before. Uh, I'll take this. No need to wait until the last second. I'm going to need lots of fuel here at some point, maybe before I, I am done streaming here today. Oh, great. These guys don't hang out too long. You got to get them when you get them. Any gel? No. All right, that's going to be it. I don't care who else comes in. I'm, I'm taking off. Unless there's one right in front of me. I got uh, some pirating stuff to do. I bet you there's a way I could configure this so it wouldn't be in the way so much, but... I really don't feel like messing with it at the moment. I have a berry. I think the planet's down here, isn't it? Yeah, this uh, this ship is constantly changing its... Uh, oh, what am I doing? I, out of habit, was going to the settlement or something. I don't know what it was. Look at this big fleet. Look at that growing fleet. I love it. I do love it. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, but it's interesting. That ship will flip-flop. Sometimes the docking bay is facing the side of the planet. Sometimes it's facing space. I really can't tell if there is a way to either change that, make it more consistent, or it's just random like that. I don't know. I don't know, people. I uh, spent a little time before I came back. I'm watching some uh, YouTube videos, other No Man's Sky guys. I tell you what, I like that. Um, is it Captain Cynical, Mr. Cynical? And Mr. Cynical, I think. I like his sense of humor. He puts out some funny videos. All right, approximate location. Uh, let's let's come back up here. Oops, sorry. I don't mean to do that. Dolphining. It is not a huge thing, but I, I think, I'm guessing it's right here, and if it's not, there's something here, and I'm going to investigate. <clears throat> and I get a free landing out of it. There we go. Boop, 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 boop. Put you in there. All right. Uh, oh, it is. This is it. Which makes sense. Hold on. I want to check over here. Give me some projectiles. Oh, I can go in this way too. Anything over here? No. Hey there, buddy. I'd like to talk to you for just a second. Friends, such a wonderful hour for our meeting. Know that the pirates held me captive, that I had nothing to do with their illegal activities. Tell Gek Trade Federation I am innocent, yes? Here, take this. Take this as a token of my goodness, friend. Keep mouth shut. The life form offers me their advanced survival blueprints. They claim to have been a captive of the pirates, but I have my doubts. The blueprints appear to be given only in exchange for my silence. Well, I don't have any choice. So they're gonna let me accept them. I take the advanced survival blueprints and leave. There is nothing more for me here. Well, I'm not gonna leave yet. I'm gonna come in here and take a look around. What do we got? No. Oh, good lord. There's a lot of slots there, though. So I guess it's a C class because it only has these. The more technology I, it goes up. Let me let me check this out. I'm gonna compare and contrast. Yeah. 
It actually has more slots. Yeah, it's got to be because I got it tweaked out. I'm not going to buy a... How much is it saying it's costs? No, no, I don't... Yeah, I could pay for it. I got three million, but I'm not going to do it. Oh, you know what I want to do before this day is done? Get the uh, Atlas 3 pass. In fact, I think after I'm done with this thing for uh, this guy, I'm go we're going to make that a priority. Mm, no. Don't really have anything I want to buy for you right now. Any any nanite or data things around? Let me look. Sometimes there's just little cubes sitting on a table. Nope. All right. Let's go back. I think... Did it tell me to go back to the armor? I would think it did. Yep. Oh, no. Wrong button. Wrong button. Let's get off this world, this stinking planet. Nothing but ne'er-do-wells and deceptors. Where are you? Oh, my capital ship is someplace in that direction. I doubt I'm going to hit it on... That did not give me a very precise uh, target, but... All right, I'll stop. I was um, contemplating just going on, but tack with it. We'll see what this guy wants. Oh, uh, no, he's got garbage. Yeah, you got nothing I want, buddy. Sorry. So sorry. On your way. Well, I saw the emblem for my capital ship pop up, but then it disappeared. Oh. Ran out of gas. Let's try this again. Well, it is, uh, looks like it's targeting the armor, so maybe it will take us right to a ship. Yes, nice. Now, let's see, it, this, uh, the bay doors, oh, look at that cool fleet. Yeah, this is worth it. God, I got a lot of, whatever those are, um, trader ships, which I don't mind. I'm not really sure. I haven't really gotten a feel for it myself yet. And I haven't really, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Okay, okay, okay. See, normally, sometimes that thing makes that noise and it just sucks you right in. And sometimes, like just then, it don't do nothing. Let's see if I can get this. Sorry about that excruciating loud noise. That is like a real anomalous noise in this game. I was asking, um, I think it was Steptoe was on here watching. <clears throat> it, uh... Hold on. Yeah, I said to make sure uh, I had a fan going. Um, that one noise when you enter the freighter is just exceptionally loud, and it's just louder than everything else in the game, so... I would have to turn down the volume on the whole game to get that to go lower, so... I guess I don't need to apologize, it's the game that did it, but it's, I know it's loud when I come into this place. It is done then. You have made them suffer. The armor begins to cough. They do not appear to be in good health. Uh... I'm gonna refuse to say, I don't want to lie to you, big guy. Do not delay, interloper. You don't have much... Okay, great. So I have to fess up to it. There was no point in offering me that... Uh, and I guess I have to confirm it. I'm going to have to lie to you. I didn't want to. The game said I had to. I shall decrypt their data, interloper. May it bring you glory. But I have another task for you. It is almost the end. I hope it's the uh, daggers. Oops. I'm going to have to look... I'm going to look at you through this screen. There is structure on this world, a depot of little consequence. We're on the ship, buddy. But to the Sentinels, grah, they will defend it to their last drone. Attack it. Draw the ire of the Sentinels, then our hunt can begin. While you are away, I shall create a powerful upgrade so that your weapon is fit for our great war. Okay. Uh, 
Agadio, I don't know how you say his name, appears to have declined even further. This longing for the hunt seems to be the only thing keeping them alive. The Viking asks that I destroy a depot so that the Sentinels will seek us out. They promise to work on some sort of weapon upgrade while he, yeah, they, him, except that one there. Go. I will prepare your weapon, interloper. You can, you can rely on my word. Why the hy why the hyphen there? Uh, where am I going? Objectives updated. Locate a Sentinel Depot. Okay. I'll do that. Uh, I'm guessing it's down on the planet somewhere, right? Right under my feet. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna take the teleporter down there. What am I thinking of? I'm gonna go do this and then I gotta take this sweatshirt off. I was outside and uh, it's definitely a uh, hoodie sweatshirt. Sweatshirt. This is the settlement. Weather. Uh, but... My radiators have got this apartment like a sauna, which I love. I'm going to take the sweatshirt off and open the window a little bit more. Kind of crazy, but even in the dead of winter, I got to have a window open a little bit, usually. All right. Where is... There it is. It's that direction. How far is it? 13 minutes. Let's take the ship. Let's pretend we're in L.A. and we have to drive everywhere. Oh, I miss all my people. Nobody's here. Oh, purple ship. Purple ship. That's really cool. What is that? It's only a C-Class. I had to, I have to remind myself that uh, just because a ship looks cool doesn't mean it's state-of-the-art. But you can change those cosmetics anytime you want. You know, I've never really... I might have done it my uh, first playthrough and just don't really have a good, strong recollection. I'm pretty sure you can change the cosmetics. I don't think it costs anything. I don't think. I think you go to that ship uh, station on the space station where you scrap things, and I think you can just uh, tweak your cosmetics there. So, but I haven't really played around with this one yet this little ship it's interesting I've really gotten used to wait okay it's gonna take me right there now I see let me land up on this hillside higher ground is always a good idea I'm not much of a military person but I know that <clears throat> I guess I gotta go destroy all this stuff. This would be a good time to bring the Minotaur over, but uh, I don't really have any of his weapons upgraded. He can just paralyze things, which is not bad. I did notice uh, when I went back and watched some video of the one stream where I was using him, I, I was, well, I panicked completely. But I thought he wasn't doing any damage, but it showed that the... Um, that paralyzing uh it wasn't really a beam grenades really they were uh, he was lobbing them it was actually doing some damage but it didn't seem like a lot oops wrong thing uh what do we got this on we're gonna have to get this on bolt caster uh but the damage it was doing didn't seem to be offsetting the uh, little repair drone which my Minotaur, I don't think, was going to kill. So, it was a futile battle. So, uh, let me go ahead and get in these. So I have them in case I gotta run away. Oh, good lord! What the heck? What is... What are you doing, jerk? Alright. That guy came right out of those things. And I gotta get away from... Them. Okay, they're going to be investigating, I think. He had his little red beam on, but... I think I got away from him. Uh, I don't think that was right. Let <laughs> me right out of those things. 
Uh, I think no matter what I do, I'm going to get assailed by these guys, so... We might as well just get started. Oh great, and let all the little beasties coming at me. Let's see if I can get away from these guys. Alright, I don't really care about you other animals. Where's my ship? Run away! Run away! I did get it, right? Return to the armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Oh, look at all of those little red dots. That was not so hard. I didn't mind just jumping into it like that. I know. Hostile scans are always detected. Where's my ship? It's really close, right? I think. I think it's it right there. Okay. Look out, look out, look out, look out, look out, look out. Where's my uh, freighter? There it is. I hope this is my freighter. I'm pretty sure it is. Looks like my freighter. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get off me. I'm running away from you. Can't you see that? All right. Once again, Scooter saves the day. Nice job, Scooter. Proud of you. Proud of you, buddy. For a little space gerbil, you do okay. All right, let's go see what the armor has to say for himself. I... These guys do have a lot of run and fetch it missions. They really do. I'm really hoping this one right here is, I think the last one is he wants two Viking daggers, which I have been holding on to. I have detected them. Their eye is upon us. Really? Come on. How many? Oh, okay. You have done it, haven't you? Your actions have summoned them. Oh, great. That's right. There's a final battle. I am sorry, Interloper. I will not be able to assist you in your fight. Really? That's a shock. I am too weak. Take this upgrade module and prepare for their arrival. Okay. Not sure how much good that's going to do me. They approach. But before the final fight, I have another task for you. Really? I need to be strong to serve you. There is a, sub a substance. Uh, an offering freely given by the young of their elders that may yet restore me. Okay. I myself spent years enmeshed within the harvest cir circuits. My organs sacrificing their enzymes for the fleet. I was glad to do so. Well, don't complain about it now then. But we need not repeat such a torment today. Oh good, this is the Viking daggers. Uh, enzyme remnants found on Viking daggers should be enough to heal me now. Great, I have those in storage, my friend. Whatever sacrifice Corporal had made for years, for others, they do not appear to have reaped the same benefits in their old age. The Viking's body is scarred, their speech labored. I cannot imagine they will survive another year. The armor requires Viking daggers to prevent their fruit. Great, because I think I have those. Uh, I may just be able to hand it to them. Viking appears relieved, they say nothing, but there is a look of hope behind their tired eyes. All right. Uh, yeah, get the geology cannon. I'll use that another time. Hey, buddy, I think I got them for you. I'm afraid, interloper. I feel my end approaching, but I am not strong enough. I know I should have faith, but I... The nightmares, interloper. The things I have seen. I'm not your therapist. The crimson eye behind my eyes. The wound upon the world. Got it, got it. I understand. I don't interpret dreams. I'm sorry. The Viking grows silent. They appear troubled. Um, I'm going to reassure you. Not very strongly. Gra, you're worthy interloper, I will admit. Okay. Uh, let's see if you're going to let me do it now. I have not been idle in your absence, interloper. I have crafted another upgrade module. Well, you're pretty useful after all for your ship. But the daggers, I can smell the battle enzyme from across the room. Give them to me. Okay, relax, relax, relax. The Viking takes the dagger and plunges it into their own arm. You crazy. They immediately revive, their spirits restored. You are a strange lot. You Viking, that sounds like Viking. Very clever, hello games. Okay, positron ejector. Well, I'll look at that another time. No, we are ready, interloper. The sentinels are here. 
and you shall head, head, head out to meet them. This day shall be glorious, traveler, as it has been before and shall be again, not to quote Battlestar Galactica. The Viking looks at me with pride. I seem to have provided them with renewed purpose and a means of self-mutilation, apparently. Of this, I am glad. By placing my world under threat and getting me to summon so many sentinels for pointless battle, when I am back, I will need to speak to the armorer about the future. Yeah, yeah we will. The armorer warns me that multiple sentinel forces have arrived near our home. I must defeat them. I wonder if it's going to be on the planet or up here in space. Gra, 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 gra. Okay. Uh, I'm not using all that. See, that's the thing, too, about it not being more difficult to survive on the hardest settings is... I don't know. When, it, when I, I'm enjoying the game. Don't get me wrong. I really do like it. No big problems. But I'm not even contemplating trying to build or install these because the gradation, the level of difficulty, and the fear of my little toon space gerbil's life ending has not been imminent enough to force me to upgrade things. I like something where you just absolutely have to upgrade and get better or you're not going to make it. But that's not here and there. Just a little aside. Anyway, where are we at? Uh, got it. Accelerator knife. What am I supposed to do? Okay, I, I have to talk to this guy again, but I, ha I got to take... It's become imperative I take this sweatshirt off. I'll be right back. Actually, I'm right here. I just have to take my headphones up. Oh, good. And I'm going to open a window. There we go. Okay. I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Oh, boy, I tell you what, man. The picture on my little phone looks really pretty. That's not bad at all. Okay. Uh, the picture of this stream is what I'm referring to. Do not waste time babbling, traveler. <laughs> Shut up. Have you been listening to my stream, you jerk? Go fight. Do not waste time babbling. All right. Uh, this is going to be interesting. I have a feeling I'll probably have to go to the planet for this. But let's see. Maybe I can engage them in space. That would be fun. Or deadly. You know what? You know what would be really funny, but not really funny, but actually pretty funny? Me sitting here jibber jabbering about how nah, the game's not really hard enough, and then I go out here and just get my butt served to me. Give me a second, I can't pass up. I can't pass up this tritium. Alright. I'm not gonna go run over the other guy. Whoa! Whoa! That guy came right. Alright, hello games. This is an awesome game. Absolutely awesome, but you gotta work on this meshing. Uh, too many things are able to go through. Too many other things they shouldn't be able to go through. And I speak mostly... That thing probably wouldn't have hurt me, but that uh, little animal on the planet coming through those barrels to try and eat me. That was not cool, Robert Frost. Nope. No jelly, but I'll take your tritium. Thank you. I, I'm hoping... And I don't think it's a vain hope that uh, we're in this stream in a couple hours. Uh, there will be some more frigate missions to run. Alright, uh, I'm out. And now I have to look for the little gun icon. I don't see it. I'm looking at my HUD up there and I don't see it. Is it hidden behind it? No, there is... no. Locate Sentinel Forces. Okay. I would like to... normally... There's... the little gun icon for the armor is usually someplace on the map. Is it in a different solar system? It might be. That wouldn't make sense. It, the first time I went through this, and I went through a little storyline, they... they just, uh popped up all over the place at my base. Let me look over towards the base. Where is the base? There it is. It's my base that I haven't been back to in days. Alright, what am I going to do? Locate Sentinel Forces. 
All right, I'm going to go down to the uh, settlement and are you, are you the baddies? Are you just normal baddies? It seems as if you are in luck, stranger. We sell protection for passing. Oh, do you? Do you? Uh, why don't you, you kiss my, my photon torpedoes. I know, and what's great is they're gonna approach right in the middle of my fleet. You're gonna get toasted. You're gonna fire, you're gonna go right into my firing solution. Oh! Oh! Where are you? Where are you? Come here. Good lord, he's, he's, uh, he's wily. There we go. Oh, thank you for crossing right over my fire. I'm just way out of town, buddy. That is much appreciated. Come on, get it down, get it. Oh, God, I... Boy, he's good. Oh, he's not good. He's just an AI thing, but... He is evasive. Where, where are you? Where are you? I see, the, I see the damage. I can see your ship. Ah, uh, it's gonna get him. Is that it? Nice. Uh, that w those weren't the pirates, were they? Nope. All right, back to uh, the original plan. Where is the old settlement? It's down here, isn't it? There it is. There it is. There it is. Let me get back. Third person. That'll help. Yeah, I wonder, uh, well, I'll find out. It shouldn't, but I wonder if that thing glitches out if you're in the, uh, you set it up in the freighter, because last time, oops, 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 oops. Where's my landing pad? Right there. Oh, you kind of... I'm not going to keep going on about it because it's not important and I'm not upset about it, but this particular session, there are a lot of odd things have. Oh, good lord, good lord, I found them. Enough chit chat, enough chit chat. I found the baddies. Come on. <laughs> just walk around my spaceship like, hmm. I'm just doing some dumb commentary and these guys, oh, good lord. I better get, I need to get over here so I can run and hide if I need to. Use these buildings a little bit more strategically. Oh, oh, good lord, I didn't see you. I think this filter that I have this thing on is not good. It's beautiful for playing. Oh, get up, get out of here. How many little mechanical things are there? There, get, get, you need to go. And there's another one. Unfortunately, they die pretty easily. I don't know how many of these things. I'm pretty sure there is a counter. Oh, good lord, good lord. Run, 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 run. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Let's get in here. Who oh, is you? Let's get that health back up if I can. I'm going to let my health... I got engage and destroy. Five of eight. I only have three more of these things. Let's uh, take a moment. Think about what we've just done. There we go. I see the little red dots there. Good. Health is back up. Let's go. I need to get rid of that jerk. Do those things just magically show up and replenish? Because they are irritating. It looks like they do. I don't think this guy really has any firepower. Oh, wait, I forgot. There's all kinds of waves of these things. There's going to be a dog, I think, at some point. Yep. Yeah, those, uh... 
those repair drones just seem to be never ending. They seem to have an infinite supply of those, which I think is bogus. Oh, I ran, oh, back up, back up smartly, Scooter. Oh, good lord, where'd you come from? Oh, you son of a gun. I cannot get, I'm getting in a crossfire here, which is not good. Reload. Hold on, am I, am I almost out of ammo? I better start collecting that stuff. How's my health? Health is not awful, but it's not great. It's not perfect, that's for sure. Where are you? There you are. I think, if I remember correctly, I'm gonna get a dog here soon. Good lord, man, these guys are everywhere. This is some excitement I didn't anticipate. I forgot how nasty this battle was. I need to get that, me that mechanic up there. He's hiding back behind that building. Oh, come on. How can he be repairing that thing from way over there? Bogus. Oh, good lord. I need to start picking up some of these. Come on. You know what? I don't mind these mechanical things, but I have killed... I don't know. I can go back in the stream and check it out. I have killed a bunch of those things. Thank you. I can see my, uh, my drone over there helping out. I have killed a ton of those. Alright, uh, the more coming. Let me see if I can scoop some of this up before they get here. I need more ammunition. Where are they? Uh, I don't see any red. They're searching. Okay, let me see if I can uh, hide out. Oh, he says it's saying he awaits the terminal. Did I get him? I'm going to wait and see if this uh, subsides on its own. There, they deactivated. Okay, I must have gotten them all. All right. All right. Let's uh, teleport up there. I think we did what we were supposed to do. Uh, shoo, that wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Although I did get all the way down to almost zero health at that one point. Alright, wait. What, what is this? Why, what, I've never seen that alert thing before. What is going on? What ship, am I on my ship? Hold on, I am on my ship. Give me a second here, I'm, I'm a little bit... Um, wait, what happened here? What is that? That's not supposed to be there like that. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I... Why are we under alert? I'm going to see if I can talk to the captain. There's some... Look at this. This whole thing is messed up. I'm going to have to go out. Uh... He's not telling me anything is wrong. This is messed up. Yep, very messed up. There have been all kinds of weird glitches today. Look at this. All right. Um, I'm debating if I should go do a save game. I'll do it here on the ship. I'll do it. I'll do a restore point down at the ship. And then I'm going to go back out. And come back in again. Because this is... Uh, from from the go in this particular uh, session. There we go. There have been weird glitches. Let's see if we can change this. I hope so. Let's try this again. Yeah, immediately starting out with that uh, 
settlement thing where they t it obviously was supposed to insert some random item and said it just said item and then almost everything since then um i'm gonna take a second before everything renders in but i can get up there well the uh the alert seems to be gone well here's the interesting thing let me go back here and double check yeah. Um, clearly, the programming is there for some sort of alert sig signal. If the ship is under attack. That was, I think, clearly a glitch. But I'll be curious to see what happens when the ship actually is under attack. And why it would be under attack. And what I would do about it. You survived where Herc fell, Traveler. Forgive me. I was wrong. My whole life I was wrong. It is not the dead that deserve our service. It is the living. It is you, Traveler. It is you. And you alone. And Dwayne the Rock Johnson. The Viking promised not to cause any more trouble for the base. Thank you. Appreciated. Apologizing profusely, telling me that the living deserve service more than the dead. That I especially am worthy of their aid. The armor awards me with a rewards me with a token of my great victory. I'll take it. What is it? It has been an honor to serve you, Traveler. Go on in glory. Okay. Little blaze javelin, sure. That's good among friends. Gra, Traveler, I've been inspired by your actions to craft a multi-tool of great power. Would it please you to examine it? It's, this is going to be a piece of crap, if I remember correctly. I mean, let me examine it. Behold, Traveler. Uh, it's a B class. I think the other one that I got was just awful. Uh, it, it doesn't seem very good, but you know what? He tries so hard, this guy. Uh, and we can have multiple multi-tools. So, yeah, thanks. Thanks, big guy. I know you haven't been feeling well, so I'll take that in consideration. Um, I do need to check and make sure that I am not wielding said multi-tool. Yeah, we gotta get rid of that. Uh, oh, wrong thing. Hair trigger on that. Let's get rid of that. Not that it's a bad thing to have more light, but here we go. Uh, let's get this bad boy back up. There we go. I've been inspired by your actions. Yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. I just took it. Wait. Oh, God. I just took this from him. I'm going to take it, and I, I sure do hope. Install blade. Please tell me that it, did, it didn't put two of those in my inventory here. Let's see. No. Yes. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. I, I don't know how many of those I can have, but I certainly hope that doesn't take up a slot that I can use something later. Um, at some point, he wants... No, I don't want the crap in there. All right, what, what am I supposed to do here? Clearly, it's it's waiting for me to do something. Install Blaze javel Javelin. I will, but not in that crappy thing. Let's go over here and... There we go. I, I honestly, sincerely hope it doesn't expect me to put that... I don't have a Blaze Javelin yet, do I? No. There we go, there we go. What does this need? Wiring Loom? Always. And if I remember, I have not seen it yet. I don't think it's possible to craft a wiring loom. I did not see a blueprint for that. All right, let's get over to the old base station. Get us a uh, wiring loom. Did I, was I calling it a traveling loom? I think I did. I'm so dumb. Hmm. Oh, it's nice. It's cooling off in my apartment a little. 
There we go. How many do I need? I didn't even bother checking. Uh, just the one. Good. Right. Objective complete. Great. Hmm. That thing looks like a bit of a glitch. That that looks like a data cube, but it's not working. Uh, did that finish it up? Or ye old armorer? I think it did. What does he expand the base with? Okay. Acquire a circuit board. Uh, I just put this on this. Why are you telling me about the scrap dealer? Don't care about the scrap dealer. Can I make a circuit board? Let's see. Good lord, this thing filled up. Let me sell off some of this garb. Well, before I do that, let me see if I can make a circuit board. I just realized I'd go over there and sell all that stuff. Heat capacitor and polyfiber. Let's see if we can make a heat capacitor. Hmm. Man, I really don't. I just, I honestly, it's a Saturday and I just want to chill. I have to go back. Too many iterations. I could probably look and buy that stuff, but it's a fortune, I'm sure. Let's, you know, let's do something else. Let's, uh, let's pick a different thing. I do want to wake this guy up. Uh, kind of left him hanging over there. Let's go ahead and, and he actually takes time between his stuff to reboot, do all this other stuff. Um... Let me look and see. Nope, it doesn't have any of that listed. The monolith might be on the planet down here. Let's go see. Hello, beautiful ship. Now, once I get the... There we go. Perfect. Once I get uh, my fleet maxed out, my next big purchase is going to be an explorer. And I'm going to spend some time tooling around in that. Oh, excuse me. I'm leaning back so much farther than normal in my chair. This is the laziest of weekend grinding going on. Oh, is this the approximate one? Because if it is, I wonder if this over here might be where I'm going. He said somewhat sarcastically. Yes. Now, I can't really remember... I think I have gone through... Yeah, I've been to this thing, obviously. Maybe it's the same one I came to for this guy before. Yep, none of these things. Alright, here we go. Lots of binary code. I approach the monolith and prepare to insert the Corvax core within the dais. The structure looks as if it was made for such a moment. Put that in there. Error, error, Atlas, obey, Atlas, error, error, run, error, run, error, 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 error. Life form identified, Corvax Echo, purpose, servant of traveler, analysis, verisimilitude, failure, emotional breakdown, traveler infection. I don't like the sound of this. Solution, terminate, insulate, insulate, protect, wipe, rebooting, one, two, Ellipses, three ellipses. Monolith offline. You, what? You're not going to talk to me? All right, fine. That's just fine with me. Yeah, I'm not saying the stream is any great shakes. Some people seem to enjoy it. I certainly enjoy doing it. I don't think this... Eh, it makes perfect sense. Depending on, I guess, where you live. But definitely in the colder climes, that if it's a Saturday afternoon and it is bearable at all out, 
everybody is going to be out and about because nobody's out here. I think Scooter's last great adventure, once I have plumbed the depths of everything I want to do with Scooter, that's when we will get into multi multiplayer. <clears throat> I think there'll be a lot of I have a feeling I might end up really enjoying it. But there are enough distractions for moi. Just in the regular game. Boy, I'd say one thing, having a big fleet makes, makes it a lot more uh, dicey getting back into the ship. Now, it seems like if you come in perpendicular to these things... Good God. That thing is really loud in my ears. I can only imagine how it sounds going out in the stream. So, again, apologies. All right. Let's go wake the scientist up. Tell him the bad news that I don't think he's going to remember anyway. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Hello. Good morning, sunshine. Backslash, backslash, backslash. Scholar entity Lo Yanez shell, shell sits in front of me, awaiting reconnection. I fear for what has happened to their data core. Shell reconnection, carapace online. Oh, come on. Shell reconnection, carapace online. Yo, greetings, unknown entity. Oh, come on. You know me. I passed my test, sharing this joy via the exchange of technology. Uh, thank you. I already had that blueprint. How do you feel about structural analysis, stranger? Oh, good God, I can't have this conversation with you again. The scientist is once again be reset. But without a connection to the convergence, I fear they are doomed to repeat this cycle forever. I would that thing need to stretch. It's kind of a cool little touch, but... It looks like just a carryover from some of the other uh, models in this game. This cycle forever, from the moment they met me in the space station until their collapse into loneliness. Perhaps I can find them a convergence cube. Hey, there's a thought. They might be unified with the rest of the Corvax and escape. All right, let's try it. The scientists deserves this chance at reconnection. They have helped me greatly, and they have taken good care of their beacon. What am I going to do now? Uh, updated. Targets outside local solar system. All right, let me see if I can find it in the old teleporter. May have been there already. I don't see it listed. Oh, here we go. Suspect Corvax. That might be... Yeah, I think that is it. I saw the little uh, symbol for the mission on there. That, that's it. Right here. Let's get over there, shall we? Try and take care of our... Poor, poor scientist locked in this endless cycle. Any more coffee? Hold on. No. No more coffee. When I finish this mission, I gotta put some water on. Here we are. Let me tab out of that. Uh, I'm guessing it's on the planet. Let me do a little quick circle. There we go. There's that. Where are you? Down here. Yeah. Let's get down there and see what's what. Hello, ship. I might just... Oh, God. Caught in the ship's jet wash. What are you gonna do? Huh? Let's try this again. Now, let me make sure I jet far enough away not to have that happen. And still, not fly into that debris field. Asteroid field, whatever you want to call it. 
Undiscovered planet. Let me hit this, see if anything shows up. Give me some info. There we go. Huh. Looks like a pretty dark planet. See you on the dark side of the moon. Welcome to whoever's watching. It says I got four viewers. I know two of those are me. <laughs> I am 50% of my uh, fan base right now. Welcome. Hope you're having a good weekend. Scooter has yet... I think I'm going to have to check when I go back out, but I think he's around... He's over 30 hours right now into this game, which I don't know why I was so pessimistic. But I did not think he would make it this long. Okay, I don't want to land and waste launch fuel. Just show me where it is. I'm going to look around a little bit here and see if I can see any structures that look like they might be what we are, in fact, looking for. Because I still haven't found what I'm looking for. I have seen the highest mountain. I don't even really know the rest of the words. I gotta go. Uh, Bono was on Colbert a couple nights ago. And I caught a little bit of it. Some people are just... I don't know. I guess if you're a fan, you see things differently. But some people who are unquestionably legendary, whether you like them or not, who've... Uh, done something epic sometimes you see them in interviews like well hmm, that's not so much and then there are other people like bruce spring sings another one here we go i know i'd find it but you see them in interviews like oh you really are something special that's what i think anyway oh good lord what are you doing why are you going into this oh you got to be kidding me what just happened <laughs> what? What was that nonsense? Uh, okay, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. What is going on? I can't get out of here. Can I get out of here? Oh, are you kidding me? All right, well, let's get the old brain manipulator out and see if that does anything. Okay. Okay. Uh, I see daylight over here, but I think it's... Oh, that's... It even has the echo effect, like I'm inside a cave. As far as the game is concerned, I'm inside this cave. These things are not going to open for me. There, that'll open. There we go. Uh, this is a bazaar. So it wasn't... Logging out and logging back in... What? Am I stuck in a volcano? What is going on? Ah, oh, Scooter. If I get you killed, I, I mean, well, it's not me. I'm not going to get you killed. See, that's the edge of the mesh right there. Let's see. Did I get through? I did. Nope, I did not. There. Nope. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Let me try over here with the... Uh, Brain manipulator. Is it doing it? Maybe, you know what? Let's try this. Let's go under the wall. This is what I'm going to have to do. Can, nope. The mesh is going down that low. Maybe I can get low enough to get under this. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Definitely forcing me to be creative. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I wasted a whole... Okay, why why you give me that? This clearly is not what I need it for. Here we go. I think I think I can go under this. Which is what I'm gonna have to do. If it'll let me. Did I get out? Did I get out? I did. Scooter, you are so smart. 
get back to bolt caster. Uh, Scooter, sorry. I spoke too soon. We are not that smart. Oh, come on. That looks like it's on the other side. Let me let me try this again. Hello, game. What is wrong with you today? Let's go down a little lower. Okay, I need my magic here. There we go. Let me see if I can... Are you gonna go up? I have a feeling, like I, like I said from the very beginning, if Scooter dies, I have a very strange feeling it's going to be from something dumb, a glitch. Okay, now he's out. Nope, he is not. Alright, uh, we're just going to fly. I, I'm going to see. Hope to God the ship actually makes it out of here. Alright, and if not... Come on, get out. There we go. You glitchy son of a gun. It. I put it on autopilot, and it automatically flew me right into the side of that mountain. I wasn't scared. Scooter was a little scared, but he's a little guy. Alright, let me make sure I'm on bolt caster here and re reloaded. I'm not even sure if this is the right place. Uh, and as it turns out, it's not. So, that was truly almost for nothing. All right, here we go. Oh, no, you know what? That was sending me back to uh, the approximate location. No, it wasn't. Oh, I'm confused. That getting stuck in that wall messed me up. All right, all right, let's, I'm gonna go check this out over here. have one of those lava balls fall on me. As long as I'm here, might as well collect some of this. Look at that. That side of that mountain coming in on me? It is. Maybe this is meant to be this way. Like the volatile nature of those things, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to give... I'm going to give Hello Games the benefit of the doubt. Look at that. The mountain is coming to the side of that. Let me see here what this thing is telling me. Yep. Subs current objective suspect. All right. Let's see if I can take off if I have not, in fact, used up all of my launch fuel. And we are going... I'm going to put down a beacon, hopefully, to... Um, let's see. Can I land when there's... There we go. That's the direction we want to go. Said about a thousand units. Please take off. Thank you. Where is that beacon? There it is, right there. Let's try and go this direction. All right, that looks like it might be it. Yep. Well, I mean, there's a place to land, which is good. Oh, game, you make yourself so exciting when you glitch like that. Thank you for not ma making me waste launch fuel. I do appreciate that. Well, there is the scientist beacon. Quest beacon. How do I get in? Thank you. Uh, why do I have a feeling I'm going to have to blast this door? Because I'm going to have to blast this door. I hope those uh, red dots are on the other side and not inside. I'm going to take all the goodies, because I don't think those guys are going to come in here. I really, of course, the way this game is going, they're going to spawn right inside my exosuit here. Alright, did I get everything? I think I did. Let's shut this down, shall we? Or do whatever we have to do. As I approach the terminal, I sense an immense sadness and grief. I hear the echoes of a thousand souls, entities whose life was stolen from them long ago. 
Non-convergent user registered. Thank you. On the display, I see the production line of this factory, a vast array of cubes infused with the memories of an entire species. They appear to be caught within an endless cycle of trauma, unable to do anything but repeat their tragedy. The terminal identifies these items as convergence cubes. Okay. Should I upload the memory? I'm, I'm going to do this. I haven't done this one. I attempt to extract a cube from the production line. I succeed, but I cannot help feeling that I have committed some terrible crime. Well, all right, well. Perhaps I shouldn't have done that. Uh, all right. Is that my buddy? I don't think it is. Where is my ship? There it is. It's on that side. All right, well, it looks like they're not attacking, which is good. Uh, I don't believe I got all these tasty treats over here. So let's do that, since things seem to have calmed down. Uh, I think I should have downloaded the information, but if I'm going to play this game for a while, which I think I am, might as well try everything. I probably shouldn't have just taken that like that, but... What you gonna do? Alright, where is... I need to go to a different solar system, so I need to get back to the space station. Where are you? Uh, how much do I have? Now, nah. I could try and go over to that fleet I just heard uh, pop in, but... There we go. I don't want to waste the time and then find out I don't have enough units. Wait till I get uh, a little more flush. When the fleet comes back and we send some more out, we should have some good, uh, good coinage on us. Yeah, I'm hoping to get uh, 300 subs by this weekend. I don't have too far to go for the uh, 4,000 hours on the channel, so. that's That one's a lot easier. You just stream, put some videos out, and it just accumulates. Subs the subscriptions are much harder. All right, let's get back home, talk to the scientists, see if I made a colossal error here. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Here we go. I'm getting to know you. I'm getting to know all about you. Alright. Where is me old scientist? Hey there, buddy. Yeah, I'm right here. I don't know who you're waving at, but we need to talk. Stranger, I fear something unusual is occurring. Is this facility shielded in some way so that signals are unable to escape? Yeah, we've talked about this. Scholar Entity, or however you say his name, is once again becoming aware of their isolation. The Convergence Cube may be their only hope. Let's see. I insert the cube. The Corvax is temporarily startled, but soon their lights begin to flash in a familiar pattern. I cannot be sure, but the plan appears to have worked. Forgive me for asking, Entity, but did I know you once? You seem familiar. These terminals, they are of my own design. One machine even called me its parent. What? Attempted to convince me of its love. Ew. I deleted the bug, of course. I run a proper code base. I did harvest some useful blueprints from its store, however. Would you care for them? Why not? Uh, whatever relationship we had developed has gone, replaced only by this cloud of unknowing. Perhaps it was an error. Perhaps this being was the true self of the Corvax, Corvax all along. And the one I knew was just a sickness, a distortion. I cannot know. I may never know until the next update from Hello Games. Take care when constructing those objects, Traveler. The plans were created by an error, after all. 
Okay, I already have that. And then, you know, this is why... I mean, uh, on other playthroughs... Fine if you don't want to take the time, but if you play through the game, it kind of seems like you'll end up with all the stuff you need without having to pay for it. Uh, it has moved me on to another... Are we done, you and I? Yeah, we're down to just one screen here. I don't even have to, like, log over it. That is going to take, I think it's probably right around, tw around 12 hours or something now. I'm going to talk to this guy again and make sure we're done. Quite sure I'm fine. Please see me be life form. The Corvax no longer wishes to speak with me. They spend their days in analysis now, in reveries of data and synthesis. I will leave them alone. They are content now. Huh. You know, I, I think the other outcome when I got the knowledge was it talked about how his species was destroyed and he was very unhappy. So, maybe I did the right thing. Uh, and also, let me take a look here. This is what I wanted to know. This is what I wanted. Do I? Yeah, the Viking daggers are gone, so I must have given them to him. All right. So that one is definitely done. Let me do a quick perusal. Nobody is in the orange. They're all good. My ships are good. Let me double check, make sure I got nothing going on up here before we get into another quest. Nope. I do, I'm gonna say it again for the 18 millionth time because every time I open this, I think it. I really wish they would have a countdown counter in here for when another mission is going to be available but that's okay i'm guessing they're getting feedback harvest yeah i wonder if i could just go to that planet and take some tell you what if that turns out to be only 50 cactus things which it might that's going to be irritating because that's going to be a full day to get all that stuff. If it is, if I if I go to harvest that thing tomorrow, which is be tomorrow, 13 hours. Let me double check that. Yep, 12 hours. And it's only 50. I'm going back to that planet. I'm going to kill all those cactus. <laughs> if I can get some cactus flesh. All right, let me uh, do one last thing before we head off. What do you guys got going on? Yep. I thought you might have a little bit of a shenanigan up your your sleeves down there. You're always up to something. My settlers, they're active folk. Always a little something extra going on. Getting to know you. Getting to know all about you. Alright. Thanks for your help earlier, Droney. I haven't talked to you in a while. Do you have anything interesting to say? Probably not. I'm having such fun, Telemann, not Telemann. Okay, well, that's what you said last time, so as long as you're happy. You have been uh, actually very helpful. He did, uh, he was firing on those drones before. I don't know if he killed any of them. But he was doing what he could. Uh, what's this look like? All right, that's gone. 16 hours before we can collect. Not that concerned about that. Experts are looking for a new project. Polling indicates 57% approval rating for increasing industrial output, while 44% approval for improving maintenance systems. Now let's go with the people on this one. I have no real vested interest. And this one, what's this add? Metronic holograms adds mutual power generator. Ah, 601, right? Am I right? There we go. Am I gonna have to go build that? I don't see an icon to build anything. It says it's running smoothly. I'm going to take a look around. Are we on the settlers? We are. Now, usually when there's something to build, it tells me what it needs. So I'm looking around. I don't see a construction icon. So I think we're good. All right. Let me... I, I really don't want to build a circuit board. But I will. 
let me go see. I, I think they have some, uh, let me go check my galactic terminals first. Because I'm pretty sure I've seen circuit boards for sale, but I have a feeling they are outrageously expensive. Let's take a look. Let's see if I even see any. I don't, microprocessor I see. Oops. Don't know why I have two of these, but that's fine. Uh, I'm not sure if they have different things, but if I want the same of something, I can get twice as much of it by going from one terminal to the other. Medic seal. Nope. All right. No. The answer to my query is no. They do not have them for sale. Let me get back inside so my last support is not being drained. And let's once again. Uh, I'm going to look at this real quick and then I'm going to do something I just thought of. Here we go. Circuit board. I'll pin it right here. That's where I have to pin it. E. View crafting steps. All right. Let me pin it. Okay. That will probably help. Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Where's my ship? Gather frost crystals. Select frost crystal in the catalog for specific directions. How about this? I'm guessing frost crystals come from cold planets. I don't know what makes me think that. I just have a very palpable inescapable feeling that a frost crystal might be on an icy cold planet I don't know could be named like as a joke like it's actually not frosty at all hold on I gotta get a little sip of water ah, refreshing alright let's go do this let's go do it scooter There's my ever-growing fleet that I love. What are you? Let's check out this planet. Hot. Uh, kind of the opposite of what we want, except I think... Hold on, let me get inside here. There's a moon that always seems to hide behind here. What well, doesn't always seem to, it does. Let me uh, race over there. My little joystick controls, so cute. Perfect for a little gerbil spaceman. Um, uh, I think this cold planet is right near the hot one. There it is. No, that's the terraform catastrophe. But I think it is a cold planet, I think. No, nope. I don't see anything that looks like something I would need listed there. Here, there's that. Where? Oh, there we go. This is what I was trying to get to. You might be what I need. So, oh, there we go. Frost crystals. Good Lord, Scooter, you're smart. You got such a little head and probably a tiny brain, but man, is your critical thinking amazing. I gotta tell you, I was gonna take a little nap before I came out and did this, and I'm glad I didn't, because uh, I got some other things to do tonight. So it's kind of fun to come in and, uh, I don't want to say get this done, because it's a joy. But, I would have probably had to truncate the stream if I started later, because I have to go do these things. And that would have been a shame, but I am feeling the effects of not having taken a nap. <laughs> Uh, over the pan ye old pandemic, I I really honed the skill of the napping, and now I am having to break that skill. What is that over there? Settle down. There you go. Uh, by the time I actually get to 
I want to look for this over here. Look at this. Oh, what are you? Sweet root. Gather frost crystal. Okay, it's on there, so it should... No? You're not going to tell me? What do I gather frost crystal? Frost tubers. Uh, I'm going to say frost tubers sounds like a thing that might have frost crystals. What do you have? Wheat? What do you have? Sweet root stuff? Yeah, that's what I thought. Where, where, where? Oh, there it is. Haven't even really gotten into uh, gathering up. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That surprised me. No, frost tubers is what I got from that. Come on. Where are the old frost crystals? Dihydrogen. Okay. Carbon. Well, you know what I think I'm going to do? Let's get back in um, a ye old spaceship. Hey, guys, how you doing? Have a nice day. You freaky looking things. Oh, here's this guy. Where is he? I just flew by him. There he is. That guy is not nice. That's the guy that I saw going around eating everybody before. You are unpleasant. And does not fear death. They really like to drive that home. There's, I'm going to get me one of them eventually. All right, what do you got? Dihydrogen? Ah, look at that over there. Uh, ancient ruin. Uh, let me get in here and see. Uh, we'll have to go one step at a time on this. I need frost crystals. So, if I go in here... Um... What would frost crystals be under plants? Probably, right? I'm guessing. Right here. Wait a minute. You know what? I'm not going to worry about it. Frost crystal supporting planet detected. Launch. Well, this is it. I think this has got to be it, right? Yeah. Sure, it was detected. You know why it was detected? Because we're on it. Um... I don't remember what I was saying. It was not important. There we go. Boy, you really gotten you're getting better at that today, uh, Scooter. That uh what do they call it? The Daredevil Adventures types contour. Contour something? Contour sailing? I don't know what they call it. Oh, shut your face. All right, I'm going to get... I'm going to eat that. Don't need it, I don't think. Let's get Scooter fat, but I do need the space, so let's get rid of that. Man. You know, I know that when I... Uh, hold on. Yeah, that's full. I thought that wasn't stacking properly, but it is. I can get rid of that picked all that nonsense up when I was trying. Oh, look. These things just die sometimes. It's sad. Or that guy probably killed him. Meanie. Yeah, it's interesting to me. He's attacking all these other beasties, and it says he's not afraid of death. But he ain't taking a uh, little scooter on. He's afraid of gerbils. Where are you? I don't know where he is be kind of funny and tragic if he just came up behind me and uh, gnashed me while I was trash talking him. Alright, that's got to be enough. Let me get back to my ship. Uh, this uh, thermal underwear scooter as on seems to be doing the trick, but yeah. Let me see. We'll give you a... Here we go. You're doing all right now. That guy won't... No, he's just got food, I think. He's... Oh, no, I was wrong. So wrong. 
My original instincts were correct. He did want to whip me with his little plant tail. And I ignored him and I paid the price. Look at that, that's a quarter of my health up there. This guy's nasty. Here we go. Back home again. Nice job. job. Well done. Oh, thank you for the like. I just looked over there and I was like, huh, oh, there's zero likes. That doesn't happen very often. I am disenchanted. And then what happens? A like shows up. So thank you whoever did that. Whoever else is out there watching, you should go ahead and do it too. You'll feel better. It's not for me. It's for you. Um, what do I need now? Uh, I have to make a heat capacitor. So I got the frost crystals. Oh, great. I got solarium back at the base. Or maybe I have it on me. It says I got 50 there. Oh, great. I think I have to go to a hot planet for that. All right, I'll, uh, I'm going to pin this. I had the other thing pinned. So we got frost crystals. Maybe this is what I did a pin. It's in a scorch climate. This ain't no scorch climate. That's for sure. But fortune. Oh, thank you. Look at the power suggestion. Two likes. Thank you so much. Honestly, sincerely, thank you. I appreciate it. I know it's just a mouse click or tacking, tapping your thumb on some gorilla glass on your phone, but appreciated nonetheless. All right, let me get in here and find these planets. There we go. Are you the planet I'm looking for? I think this is the hot planet. Is it? Yeah, it is. Let's go get some... Solanium, solanium, however you say that. All right, I don't want to stop. I just can't help myself. Whoops, sorry, I didn't, didn't mean to shoot at you. What do you want? So happy to, yeah, don't understand enough. This just don't really think I want to buy anything, but you know what? This is a golden opportunity to get rid of some garbage. If I have any. Here. Take that. Fungal mold I hold on to. Probably oh, here's what I want to get rid of. Feline Libus. Uh I know the second I get rid of that, I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna hold on to that stuff. Yeah. Alright. Bye bye. Thank you. Good shopping with you. What plants have selenium in them? I'm going to take a look around, see if I can just figure it out intuitively. I hope. Don't know who's out there, but if it's any of the old crew, Steptoe or Guardian or, I don't know, Jed the Zed hasn't been around in some time. But I talked about it for a hot second earlier. Gather selenium. All right. It says I can... Target sweep. Yikes, that was sweet. If it's right there, that would be a deluxe. Here, let me go ahead and steal this. But lettuce should be out on Monday night, unless something comes up. It could come up. But it was good chatting with him again. I talked to him for a minute. I haven't talked to him, God, maybe a month? Both been busy doing other things. But he expressed a genuine interest in coming back out and playing I, and uh pretty sure the only game we can play together is scum so that'll be fun uh having not played in so long where where is this thing hold on wasn't there some right here nope i guess not I think it's farther away than it looks. Oh, you're flying a little low there, people. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, this planet's getting dark. No, stay close to the ground now. Oh, that... No, 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 no. Oh, good lord. I am so sorry, Scoop Magoots. I did you wrong there. That was my fault. I could tell you didn't want to do it. You were resisting, and I forced you into a terrible situation. You know, it was interesting. He wasn't that high up the ground. It kind of seems like. I don't know how the game calculates such things. That's a big, beautiful plant. 
Um, but it seemed like it was the speed he was traveling when he hit the ground. Not so much. There we go. Uh, the height, which I suppose makes sense. But I'm not sure. This game has been so buggy today, it's hard to tell. I'm going to take all this since I'm here. Where is it? Oh, more goodies. Uh, out of range. I'll take it. I'm going to regret it. I'll put it in the ship when I get over there. Is that my droid? My sentinel or... Looks like it. I should have lots of selenium. Uh, I have still yet to, and it's going to happen. It's going to take a while. I've learned lots of the basics of this game, but I have not been all the way through all the quests. And I still don't have a feel for... I don't know what you want to call it. Systems management. That's a good enough phrase for it. But eventually, I'm going to know the things. Like, I know, like, the dihydrogen and the tritium for frigate fuel. Um, I'm going to have to figure out a way, or I'll be delighted to put the mental energy into. Oh, I don't want to do that again. I'm going to, like, make him fall again. This is a, quite the sheer rock face, except I don't know any other way around it. Uh, but figuring out a way to manufacture that stuff on a regular basis in quantities that will be useful. The stuff that goes into making launch fuel. I forget the ingredients. Now that I'm getting a more solid understanding of the things that I have to craft on a semi-regular basis and the elements that go into producing said things getting a better idea of the stuff that uh, I need to be able to make. I have not really utilized um, the what is it? Solar extractor and the freighter because I have not traveled in that thing at all and eventually that's going to have to be a thing. Go into um, various solar systems with... Oh god! No, no, no. Not, not that high. Not that high. Not that high. You're getting all rambunctious there. I fell down in that hole and I got a little panicky. It's pretty. Huh. Let's just get back home here. But, um... Did I get this stuff right next to the ship? I think I did. Let's double check. Well, that one thing looks closed. Maybe I did not. I don't know if I even saw it here. I think I was so... focused. Alright. put you in the old starship. Alright. Alright. Can I make a heat capacitor? There we go. What's next? I need this, um... I know the next thing I need is... Where is it? Right here. Polyfiber. Is that any ca oh, I got tons of star bulbs back at the, um... Base, and I think I have cactus flesh. I think. Let me pin this. Uh, and let's go back to the star base because, or the uh, actually, it's the settlement. I'm still in my solar system, right? Yeah. I'm just gonna fly straight to the settlement. Actually, I am gonna go back to the ship. Uh. I think I have some, I might have some cactus flesh there too. We shall see. Yeah, in about uh, 10 minutes or so here, maybe a little bit sooner. I'll see when I finish up this little project. I'm going to take about a five minute break to get a little more coffee and uh, refresh myself. I want to 
want to try and stay out for like three hours if I can. Whoops, I don't need you. Hey, Dell. Hey, oh. Back at you, buddy. Now look at this. Am I re am I looking at this right? I think I am. Yep. Yep. It is turned the other way again. Are you going out on joy rides when I'm not around? I think this ship is just flip flopping, doing its own little thing. That's all right. I'm getting a little bit better, more facile at the flying maneuvers. Good to see you, Dell. Glad you're here. Taking some time out of your busy weekend to join us here in the uh, planetary expedition. All right, let. Uh, I'm gonna check on Cactus Flesh, and I'm gonna check with this guy real quick. Hopefully, but I doubt it. Anything? No. I got a ton of ships out there with uh, some uh, antsy crew people who are wanting something to do. And then, uh, I know I have the star bulbs. So star bulbs and cactus flesh. Let's see what we have. If we have any of that in here. I don't really have a good eye for... Wait, wait, wait. I think I saw... Wait, 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 wait. wait. What is that? Right there. Star bulbs. What is that? Nitrogen salt. I am I'm full again already. I think I have, I have found a Gex statue in there. Uh, I I have to get rid of something. Where did that come from? I think I got that as a reward for something. Anti matter. Oh, I'm doing well, Dell. Thank you. Had a very good week. Very productive week. I am very pleased. Uh, I can put. Oh, this, this one's full. Well, it's got one slot here. I'm, I'm going to have to get organized with what I put in here. Uh, I think I just saw those Viking daggers there. What? Uh, oh. Yeah, I want to fill them up in order. Eventually, I'll have to get better at... No, keep that on me. You, I don't think I need to carry around. You, I don't, I'm almost positive I don't need to carry around. That, I'm going to need nitrogen salt. No. That should go in the freighter. Let me, if, no, that's not what I meant to do. Put you back over here. Um, I keep carrying this, carrying this around like I'm going to use it right away, and I'm not, so... There, that's, that's enough space for now. When the time comes to do some of that upgrading, is, uh, I'm going to try and use the quests as much as possible to uh, achieve what we need to achieve. Where is this? This is pinned, right? Yeah. Star bulbs. 174 of 200. Okay. I think I, can, I think I have some more over here to possibly harvest think. No, maybe not. I go to the settlement because I, I think I have a ton of these that I was manufacturing on that I've dumped into an exocraft. How you doing, Dell? Thanks for the like. I'm pretty sure that was probably you. You showed up. The like showed up. Kind of suspicious, I think. In a good way. All right, let's get over here by this. I I have really been so hodgepodge about storing things. I'm gonna have to definitely get better at that. Okay, I have nothing stored in here. Let me check this bad boy out. What do I have in you? Here we go. Well, yeah, thousand star bulbs. Let's put you in the star suit for now. Now I should 
Do I have enough? What am I trying to make? The gel, right? Um, cactus flesh. Hmm, I thought I had cactus flesh. That's the thing I needed to look for. I wouldn't. I don't have any cactus flesh in here. Do I? No. Okay, so I got stuff spread all over the galaxy. Doing pretty good. I just got home from work. I've been feeling good. Uh, good. That's a good day. I'm, I'm, I like it when uh, things are going well. For good people. Alright, uh, this ain't gonna work. I need... I probably do have cactus stuff, but it would probably be just as quick, if not quicker, to go out and just get it. Procure it, if you will. Ah, I knew he was going to do that. Just disappear on me like that. That was rude. Alright, uh... I'm pretty sure if I remember, the cactus grows on desolate planets. We have this, um... What are you over here? I think the moon... I think this is a hot planet, right? And I think there is a terraforming... I'm not paying attention to you, please. Don't bother me. You're going to bother me. What? You're not supposed to carry... Oh. They're approaching... I'm not, I'm not even going to stop for you. That's how little I care. And what's going to happen is... You're going to have to deal with... My guys... It's kind of nice. Uh, maybe it's just because I have this ship tweaked just enough. Uh, frost crystals. No. What am I thinking? The cactus would be on a hot planet. No, it'd be on, it'd be on the desolate planets. There we go. That should get me away from those guys. I just don't really like dealing with them. Now, a hot planet would make sense, but I don't see anything that looks like what I'm looking for. Yep, that moon is right behind. Right there it is. Is that the moon I'm looking for? It might be. Let's get through this ring and we'll check it out. What are you? Are you a hot planet? That's an icy planet. No, I was looking at that one. Here we go. This, I am pretty sure, is the planet we want. The terraforming catastrophe. If it isn't, I'll just go back to the space station and look around till I find one. I really do. I tell you what, I do like the. I've been. It sounds like I've been railing on this game today, and I haven't. I love this game. They they need to make improvements and tweaks, but I think that they've done a lot. The the dirtiness of the control panel is something it'd be very easy to overlook. <laughs> but it's really a nice touch. They have a they have a ton of nice touches like that. I appreciate it anyway. Let me get a little more lined up with this planet. There we go. I really hope there's some cacti on this planet. I don't know if any of you have ever seen those giant cacti. I've been to Arizona once in my life, spent a couple months there. Um, and they actually have national forests that are nothing but cactuses, cacti. They are impressive. Let me see here. Landing area not clear. Can I not land on this? I let me look around first. I don't see any cacti. I think this place might be pretty barren. Which would make sense if it is a catastrophe. Yeah, I don't see anything here. Alright, this was a mistake. But that's okay. It's still pretty cool. I wonder if these things serve a purpose. Like what... 
I mean, they, I think, it, it was, yeah. Oh, you don't care about cacti then, Dell. Well, then you know, they're pretty magnificent. You might, you might just take it for granted. If, Cause every time, no matter where you live, after a while, everything just sort of becomes part of the scenery. But as a visitor, I see a red dot up there. Is that, are those guys up here still waiting for me? Huh. Interesting. Okay. Uh, that was not it. I'm just going back to the space station, and we'll we'll go from there. I went out to whatever the the national forest thing is near Tucson. Me and some buddies, and uh, hung out for the day. Took some pictures next to him. It is. It is unreal how big some of those things are. Like 30 feet tall. Nope, I'm not stopping because I'm not interested in whatever you have to offer, sir. I gotta keep reminding myself because sometimes it takes so long to get to this stuff that you're looking for. I get what I was even looking for. Now, I see something. This. This is a flourishing planet. Oh, that's my planet. What is this? This is icy, right? Yeah. It's hot. Oh, no, it's hot. It could go down there. I'm going to go down and check this out. It's probably going to be pointless, but it's a hot planet. Mm. I was pretty sure that I got this cactus in my home solar system. So let's go down there and see if we see any. Shall we? But I say that like you have a choice, but you kind of have a choice. You could make suggestions if you want. And it's possible. I would listen. Possible. I don't see any cacti. I'm going to take a... Oh, there's a... What the heck? Palm trees. Well, things that look like palm trees. I don't see anything. It looks like a cactus, though. I'll keep looking every second. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Watch you fly in there, Scooter. Uh, I don't see him here. I think it's got to be a drier planet. Which is fine. Let's go to a dry place. I think I have it pinned. So when I look at the old teleporter. I think it might tell me where I can find one. I did look back there, right? Yeah, I looked in my uh, my horticult <coughs> horticultural? Yeah, horticultural selection. And I don't think I had any. I didn't have any planted, let alone any available. So let's take a look here. Yep, cactus flesh is pinned. So let's see if it will show up. Show me on here. Nope, I don't see it pointing out anything. Nope. That's unfortunate. All right, let's go back to this. And s no, that's not what I wanted to do. S discoveries. Here we go. Uh, frost. No. Camera root. No. No. Somewhere near we're going to find it. Blighted planet. I think I, I remember that place. Here we go. In the glitchy Wuhan solar system. Are you glitchy? You're a perfect name for the game today. Wait. I am looking... Freighter Start Point Station. I... that's... okay, that's weird. I'm going to take one more quick look here. Maybe I... No? I don't see it. It showed up in the discovery thing. Am I too far away? 
he said, his voice rising. Uh, here, this is the system. Desert planet, it's right here. Now, why can't I teleport to that? That's uh, vexing to me. Because it's in this solar system. Oh. Because it was maybe because it was discovered by somebody else. I don't know. Let me let me keep looking. Maybe I'll find another one here. This one was discovered by me. Maybe the ones discovered by other people don't show up. I don't know. Usovo Alita. I don't know if that's how you would say it, but that's how I'm saying it. Just so I can remember it. Here we go. Right there. Let's get over to that dry planet with some uh, cactus flesh on it. Boy, this is, a, this is a lot of work for one circuit board. Can you imagine if in order to have a cell phone, you had to go out and find the components? <laughs> for every single part in it. I don't know, I can't... There's got to be a figure somewhere I would think about how many people and parts it takes to make up something like a cell phone. A true testament to uh, the complexity of modern-day humanity. That and every other gizmo gadget that we have. Look, right in front of us. I think this is probably the one I came to get the cactus flesh the first time. Oh, what are you? Are you a starport? I think it is. No. It is. Some sort of terminal. Observatory, maybe? Let's uh, collect uh, a few little trinkets here. And uh, get our cactus flesh. I see a lot of cactus size over here. Scooter should have got his outlaw on. Hey, stoner. Uh, when? At any particular time or just in general? Scooter can be outlaw. He can be he can be pretty badass when he wants to be, sorta. I mean, he is just kind of basically a chipmunk. Um, what do we got? I want to take a look at it. I'm probably not going to buy it. Oh, it is a B though. Oh, I don't have enough. Oh, you know what? I could. I'm not going to do it. When the time comes and I find one I like and I have enough units to do it, that's when I'm going to wear those crappy ones from uh, the armor so I don't hurt his feelings. Very sensitive, that guy. There we go, a little nav data. I think I can get some nanites around here somewhere. It's back here. Oh, it's you. Nope. Alright. Oh, let me look in here and see if we can just buy some of this stuff. Well, everybody's got a different play style. Uh, I am gonna... I was thinking about it today. Uh, I haven't checked these things out. I was talking about doing it in a different playthrough, but I think it's gonna happen for Scooter. Not right now, but eventually, and probably pretty soon. But I think we're gonna make him a total pirate at some point. Get him in an outlaw... system... I just have a lot of groundwork to lay first. I got, I really want to get through what I call these perfunctory missions. Cause I, just because I haven't ever done them. Some of them, I'm just going to say, they're not very exciting, but that's okay. Where are you? Up there? All right. Nice cash injection. Just out of curiosity, because I am not opposing your uh, sentiment at all. How do you make money being an outlaw? Just curious. Uh, Robin Freighters, I guess, is one. You can make some good cash. The thing is, I got to tell you, man, uh, it's been nice. It took a little work, but 
Scooter's got a pretty nice cash flow going. Um, what is this? There we go. Now we're talking. Yeah, we're going to get lots of cactus flesh. With the uh, freighter industry rocking and uh, haven't really worked it too hard yet. I'm trying to build it up, so I, I keep delaying things with debt and things like that. But the settlement been bringing in more and more cash all the time what are some good outlaw activities to make some money there donor grin that is in fact your real name i don't believe it i like it though reminds me of college days all right i don't know what you're talking about Oh, 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 no, 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 good lord, man. Scooter, we gotta, oh, god, this is a, this was just supposed to be a little day hike. It's turning into an ordeal. Let's get out of here. Man. Pirate system, freighter, smash and grab. Uh, I think I tried, I did that. I did that once on accident, and then one time I did it because I took a mission from uh, the mission agent. Uh, and I gotta say, it was fun. Alright, is this it? Did we get it? There's polyfiber, and now we should be able to make yield circuit board. Awesome. Awesome! Okay, we did that. Now let me uh, put this back on. That is done. Let's unpin the formula. Right here? There we go. And... Is this... Did he want it? No. Here we go. Alright. This will guide us back to the ship. But I did have a lot of fun doing it. Um, you know, for better or worse, most games... And I, I think it's fine. Uh, but they... Uh, oh, look at... That's a pretty chartreuse planet. Alright. I want to go discover that. I want that to be mine. There we go. It's a tropical planet. I just like the color pattern. Um, games tend to reward you more for the uh, what the traditionally moral choices and punish you for the not ones, not ones, uh, amoral. So I haven't really gone to the dark side of this. We'll see. I don't. I don't care one way or the other. But the only game I ever played that was really confusing, but I loved it, was Witcher 3, where you could just... It, all the choices seemed fine. But then you would find out, well down the line, a choice you made three, four hours, two days earlier was not... did not give you the result you wanted. And I thought it was brilliant the way they wrote it, the storyline, because it made sense. But I went back in that game a few times and replayed hundreds of hours of gameplay just because I got to a point and was like, no, no, we're not going to have that happen. You know, people certain, you know, people die, you lose things you didn't want to lose. It just, it all made sense and it was great storytelling and I appreciated it. But it was, it was frustrating. Um, in that it wasn't morally clear, but it was that's part of what made it great, too. But anyway, that's a long and short way of saying I'm kind of playing uh, Scooter is just a nice little country mouse. Doing what he thinks is right in this world. And once we get him established, he's he's going to break bad and just start tearing up the universe, robbing freighters, doing bounty missions against good people. He's just not going to care. It's going to be a house-proud town mouse. I trust our scientists were able to meet your needs, friend. We have the circuits we demand. Here we go. As I approached the overseer, I was almost certain I heard them talking to themselves. Are you crazy? There's the stretch all you guys do. Spitting out words and phrases in a tongue I recognize but do not understand. But seconds later, there is no trace of the venom I thought I heard. I must be mistaken. Yeah, that's it. Don't trust yourself, Scooter. Here you go. Take that. The Overseer is strange, but no more than any of the other beings I've encountered. Indeed, they have been more helpful than most. I hand over the circuits and receive my reward. What do I get? Oh, I got this already. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna say it was a mistake, but I went out and just paid the, um, the what, is, what do you use for this stuff? Scavenge data, I think? Ah, friend, you will be so happy with Merchant Oak, Oak Burger or whoever you are. I have drawn up plans for some Starship technology, but I cannot get, cannot yet sync my design with your ship. I shall need to grab a Tino ball. Okay, I think I'm growing some of those right behind us, sir. The Overseer predicted I would be pleased, and once again, they are correct. They have been ceaseless in their efforts to improve my lot. Gravitino Ball is required to finish their promised thing. Whatever it is. You will not regret it, friend. It is good we work so well together. That sounds almost like a veiled threat. Hold on. I think I might have one in storage here. You may leave, but do not be deceived. Oh, you're a poet, and you know it. Uh, we are all prisoners, even you. You abandon me. You'll find another Gek with a different face, but the same soul, the same worse. Oh, how I like the way the game is explaining why these overseers stay the same, even if you pick a new one. We are paired to you throughout time and memory. Your servants, your teachers. <laughs> That's really clever, Hello Games. I appreciate it. Merchant Oakberger suggests that if I were to dismiss them from my service, I would find another just like them. As if nothing at all had happened. They claim I am a prisoner. I can do whatever I want, buddy. I am only that I... Uh, I know only that I must trust the Overseer. I know it in my heart. I'm going to insist I'm free. You will believe what you believe, friend. <laughs> I'm going to put a chuckle in for him. Such is the nature of things. All right. Let's try this again. Okay. Uh, same stuff. We're having the same conversation. Let me go get that Gravitino ball for you. I'm going to apologize this time. Do not apologize. Oh, I didn't finish reading it. I'm so used to just clicking through that stuff. Uh, here are... This is my Gravitino ball, right? Let's see if I got any. There we go. Hey, uh, look what I found. Just in my backyard over here. There you go. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, we had this talk. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know. Uh, what am I missing here? Return to the Overseer. Did I just not move far enough away? What's wrong? Did you enjoy your adventure, friend? Yeah, my little walk back to the garden there, it was amazing. I almost tripped twice. Your expedition to find our orb? Yeah, my expedition, sure. I have waited for you faithfully. There's something about the way Merchant Oakberger speaks that, for all their kind words, suggests a resentment saved only for the deepest of enemies. But they would not have come to work here if we were enemies. I don't remember this um, with my first playthrough, because I think I went through the whole thing with the Overseer. This one's a lot darker. I wonder if it changes depending on who you pick for an Overseer. Uh, of course not. We are friends. The Overseer asked for the Gravitino Ball so they can finish the Starship technology design. Sure, take it. As ever, I am so grateful for your assistance, friend. There we go. I think I already have that. Have you ever wondered what happens after death between expiration and rebirth? Meditate upon annihilation. Harvest Mordite from the dead. Oh, I saved it. Oh, gosh, I click that too soon. Once the Overseer arrived, I have, since the Overseer arrived, I have had a recurring dream, a nightmare that feels like a memory. Flesh merged with metal, a world of glass that blinks. That's not a good night's sleep. A planet with green skies and an obsidian moon, a dream where I see my grave. As I snap back to reality, there is a moment before I can shake the image, that, that wound on the world lingering before my eyes. The Overseer asked me to harvest Mordite, the material found in the bodies of slain creatures. I'm pretty sure I've got some of that, buddy. The Overseer has served me well. Perhaps their task will free my mind from these lingering nightmares. Perhaps this task. Okay, I got that. Oh, I did get it. I'm not going to install yet. I'm pretty sure I have Mordite. I don't, I don't want to do that. 
I think I have some solar panels. Is this not going to go on until I do this? Ah. Uh, yep, I think I have to do this in order to progress with me overseer. Well, maybe it's over here. Wait a minute, expanding the base. Here it is. No, good. I, I went back up to another uh, expanded mission. All right. 100. I think I might have some right over here. I'm almost positive I do. Is that Mordite? No. Similar, though. All right. It's purple. When I say similar, I mean it's purple. Oh, come on. I got more than this. I'll put this over. I, I think... I had a thousand somewhere, didn't I? I my, my memory is that I was going to sell it all, and then I stopped myself because I was like, I'm going to probably need that. Mm, maybe I'm wrong. Misremembering, as it were. I don't think I have anything over here yet. No. All right, let me check my other storage things. Just... To be sure. Any more night than you? No. Not, it wouldn't be in that. Nothing down on the planet. Uh, I don't see any. I thought for certain I had more of that, but I think I was looking at the other purple product. And it corn fused me. Let's see if I can buy some. It's not too much money. No. Nope. Uh, I'm just going to go kill some stuff. Well, I'm going to go back to the settlement, because killing those little feline things is not only delightful because they're so mean, but you get their feline livers to sell as well as the Mordite, so... I kind of want to start on... Um, that Atlas 3 pass, but actually I think I want to start fresh on that. So I'm going to finish off this uh, little mission. I'm going to be back on again tomorrow. Uh, and I think tomorrow, first thing, that's going to be the agenda. We'll see how long it takes. Alright, it shouldn't take too long off in the wilds here. Let me make sure I'm on Boltcaster. I don't know, Blaze Javelin. Blaze Javelin might be alright. I don't know. I don't know how much damage I really don't feel. Like. Let's stick with what I know. This thing has always worked, and I got lots of ammunition, so. Now I know over by my base over here, I was getting attacked by those things all the time. I I am not sure how much fidelity they have as far as I mean Red Dead Redemption was brilliant at that. Like you almost felt like a hunter, even though you really weren't. But you could you could really find animals based on uh, your environment and different things that were going on. The different fish and uh, deers, bears. But I'm not sure how fastidious this game is with uh, the uh, hunting animals aspect. If, in fact, you can... Oh, here we go. Um, but I'm just going to go in this direction. Man, this thing is not. Uh, I'm going to. What do I have? I don't. OK, well, I got two gel packs. I can let this get down pretty low before I waste those. Or use them. And oxygen is good. So, let me get some of that. And hopefully... Now, if I was out here... And mind my own beeswax... Okay, well, I just picked up some oxygen for you. There you go. Just for that purpose. I wonder how long... It's, kind of, it's going to be kind of interesting. There we go. That's it for you. 
feline livers and more dite. How much more dite? All right, that was fortuitous. This will be an interesting little experiment. How far is that? Five hours? Yeah, I don't think I'm going to run all the way there. That'd be a fun thing to try and do someday. Have Scooter pack a lunch and just run uh, back over to the base. And by fun, I mean long and tedious. Which, I hate to say it, can sometimes be fun for me. Ooh, look at you. Are you guys going to attack me? I certainly hope so. What do you think? What do you think? Ooh, you look really weird. I've never noticed you. Have I cataloged you? What? What's wrong, buddy? What's wrong, fly face? Nope. Uh, you know what? Attack with it. Oh, good lord. Suppression measures triggered. What does that mean? What does that mean? I've never... I don't remember... That concept of suppression measures. Maybe it's said it before. And I just didn't notice it. I'm being suppressed. Now. Did that happen? Because they saw me? Or were they somehow triggered? By me just hitting that animal. Because it didn't seem like they were right there. Now, these big old crab creatures look like... Okay, where, where are these guys? There they are. They're right there. Okay, they don't see me. Oh, here we go. Good, 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 good. I want something that wants to kill me. You weren't even close to me. That makes no sense. Alright, I hate to do this, but... Oh, no, I won't have to, it looks like. Oh, you're a baddie. With your, with your weird wings. Are you? No, you're not one of the things that's been attacking me. You're kind of freaky. All right, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm going to do this. Uh, yeah, somehow I thought he would just have more of that material. Got some good old leg meat. We're going to fry that up. That'll be tasty. You have a different kind of head. Sorry. Sorry. It was an accident. Didn't mean to do it. How much more do I need? I'm just on a killing spree right now. Oh, good. I do like fly. I mean, I just feel like it's more fair to kill the things that want to kill me. Boy, that is a lot. What is it called? Mordite? Is that what it's called? Uh, all right. I'm sorry, guys. Ah, oh, gosh. I kind of almost didn't mean to shoot you, but I did. Oh, good lord. They're right here. Now, when that thing said five hours, did it mean a literal five hours like me? Or is that like a fictitious? No, I think it means it would take me five hours to run there. Uh, I'm definitely going to be just... Whoa. Calling my ship when I'm done with this little excursion. Scooter, you're getting bold and adventurous, my friend. Okay, good, good, good. Where is it? Oh, come on. These drones are just a pain. Oh, I got enough. Great. That's perfect. Are they still searching? It doesn't look like it. All right, let me call my ship. There you go. Land right there, right next to me. There you go. Let's get back to the ship. Give this guy his death meat. That's what I'm going to call it. Uh, I'll be curious to see how much that lake meat sells for. Because the feline livers were pretty valuable. When I sold them last time. Alright, where are we? 
Where are you? There we go. Let's see if I can. I'm way too close. Let's. All right. Uh, am I wrong? No. Nope. Okay, we're back topside. I don't. I don't really mind it that much. I just. Uh, it, it would, maybe at some point I'll figure out the logistics of it. Like if it's predictable in any way, which side the entrance, the docking ports will be on these ships. Because so far, it seems to be more than a tad bit random. Now let's go see what this guy is going to give me for my juicy, juicy treats I'm bringing them. These are still warm, buddy. I just got these. Like sushi. I can see the change in you, friend. You have completed your task, and I have seen the world as you see it. I do not entirely understand what I have done for the overseer, but they seem once again ready to reward me for my actions. Here you go. Here, take these schematics. May the things you build always remind you of those you killed to construct them. Oh, thank you. That's really nice. Uh, I'm not sure how many of these that I've gotten before. All right. Um, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to check with this guy one more time. See if he's got anything for me, which I doubt. Yep, I didn't think so. Then we're gonna head down here. Where's my ship? Huh, Juicy right over there. Or over here, I guess. Boy, this place has been kind of busy today. And let's hop out, and I'm gonna use that for my restore point. And I think I'm gonna call it a day. I'm still having fun out here, but I like to quit while I'm ahead. And I can tell my energy is going to flag in about 15 minutes. So before that happens, I'm going to take Scooter. Put him to bed, cutie. He's got uh, just so much energy, but he needs a nap every now and then as well. So thanks for coming out here, guys. Really, really appreciate it. If you're watching this is sometime in the future and you happen to have made it quite this far, go ahead and like and subscribe if you want. That would be awesome. All right. Uh, I'll be back out tomorrow for more adventures with Scooter. Tomorrow I'm going to uh, make it a priority off the bat to get that Atlas 3 pass. Um, I think it's within the reach. It's just going to take some work. What do we need? Let's look at that real quick. Uh, and, and so I can get an idea. So we can all get an idea, really. What that's going to take. Here we go. Uh, I don't know how much of that I have. The Emeril? Uh, but... I think I have some of it, but I definitely know where we can get some. So that's going to be our priority starting off. Maybe it won't take very long at all, and then we'll just finish up more missions. Either way, from Scooter and I here at Yold Freighter Dock Bay, it's been fun. We will see you soon.